क्लस During the creation of the password security objects, we are putting the precedence. Now, question is why it is required, isn't it right? Okay. So we understood, but uh, if there are multiple rules or multiple password policies, so how the how the precedence are juggled? Okay. So for your information, you are creating. one of the pso for the password part okay uh, i mean the, the basically it is required for password security object so let's say you have a two password security policies got my point two two password security policies and which is applying on a two different groups clear got my point now Which policy you are make it fast, which that is apply. Rest of the things will not apply. That means your first policy is for minimum password is seven character, alpha numeric password complexity. अच्छा second PSO object is very not complexity enabled, minimum two character. Third thing is <coughs> alpha numeric complexity enabled but minimum three character now all this policy is applying on a specific groups or different groups now common users is added here here and here now if you want which one will be apply so you can reduce the precedence If you reduce the precedence, it will be on top priority. So it will be applied. The rest of the two will not apply. Clear? Okay. And uh, if if uh, all these three rules are set on a specific group, okay. So uh, the precedence with the uh, the precedence uh, uh, the SPO with the precedence one will apply, right? And Ex two three exactly. will discard it, right? Exactly. Exactly. clear as per as per the requirement we can change the precedence yes to apply the sq the question you ask na this question ask in interview even i face they asking the same question they asking if i have a multiple password security object how i can apply the priority in that case you have to change the precedence okay very significant question you have asked sapon 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 sir न्यू टॉपिक इज ब्लॉक इनहेरिटेंस ग्रुप पॉलिसी इनहेरिटेंस फर्स्ट आवर टॉपिक इज ग्रुप पॉलिसी इनहेरिटेंस देन विल डू द ब्लॉक इनहेरिटेंस वाट डू मीन बाई इनहेरिटेंस inheriting means spreading from upper side to lower side spreading called inheritance that means if your structure is like that this is your primary this is your second third fourth this is your domain structure so anything which is apply on here by default in nature it is spreading to a downside so it's called inheritance now group policy inheritance order is at a glance we can say l s d o u got it this is group policy inheritance order l s d o u lh means locally
this is you can apply on site this is you can apply on domain and finally you can apply on OU so for your information whenever the policy you can apply in OU that will be the highest priority that means this policy always on top priority instead of this and this that means if if the for same policy you are apply on domain and you are apply on OU always remember the policy you are applying on OU it will be on priority you see the thing just uh, repeat repeat once okay so today I am discussing that how group policy in be inherited that means group policy how it will be inheritance order first things we want to learn group policy inheritance order so group policy can be implement or inheritance locally that means every systems every computer they have local group policy through GP edit you can go and apply the setting only for this particular system it's called local group policy group policy can be apply on site ad site domain and OU so we follow this structure called LSD OU so common interview question uh, what do you mean by uh, how group policy can be applied then you say group policy order apply on the order called LSD OU locally site domain and OU clear is that clear yes, yes. Add, uh, for your additional information group policy is very stronger when it is apply on OU how how you can say it's a very stronger that means any of the policy either in apply on site or either apply on domain and the same policy or apply on OU so it is apply which one apply on OU it will be work clear is that clear so in LSD OU in LSD OU format OU is the always on high priority so if if anything is uh, any policy sets on the OU that will prevail over this site and domain. exactly exactly clear this is actually group policy apply um, um, group policy inheritance process clear so common interview question if interviewer ask you question how group policies apply never confuse tell him group policy apply on LSD OU method what is it group policy can be applied on locally through GP edit even I can apply group policy for my this particular system just go to GP edit dot MSC so it will be applied for my own system not for any domain my base system as you say as I say you the beginning day of the group policy that group policy configuration always in two types one is computer configuration another one is user configuration so you have to apply according to the nature of the requirement clear is that clear everyone mm. yes Perfect. yes so you can create group policy locally you can create domain I mean you have created group policy domain I mean centralized group policy which is an active data environment apply on site domain and OU that's I'm trying to say this is how group policy basically work LSD OU format remember it's any any doubt any question uh, uh, first apply locally second site no, 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 and no, no, domain no, no. you are confusing this here you are confusing here I can say group policy can be apply locally site domain and OU I am going to say that group policy locally apply korajai, site apply korajai, domain apply korajai, and OU to apply korajai. Who is the problem? Yes. It's a four method. It's a four methods. Ever question hoche, ever yes, question hoche. Next question if I apply on domain and if I apply on OU, 
which is on the highest priority then your answer will be always which I am applying on OU that will be the highest priority. Uh, see that one question. So we already seen that uh, how you have applied the uh, group policy in local machine and then OU. So uh, can you just show if uh, there any example how this is applied in site and domain? Sure. So Today. that we can just get an idea. Today, 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 today practical I will show you that part. Okay 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 so what i can do today uh, what i can do today i will create simple one wallpaper policy two wallpaper policy one i apply on site one i apply on domain one i apply on ou clear got it okay and yes. then i then i will show you which one is apply whenever user login Achha.
so i'll making this as laptop okay is that clear i'm not taking in windows server i'm making this windows 2012 as a laptop or anything you can say बोलो नहीं पढ़ा ची बोलो हम्म 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 रजिस्ट्री तो चेंज करते होंगे एंटी एंटी डीएस अच्छे ने एंटी फाइव अच्छे कौन टा ना ना एक्जेक्टली टा बोलो जेटा था क्या ना एक्जेक्टली पैरामीटर टा माके बोलो किया अच्छे हम्म ताला एक बार बैटरी टा चेंज करा पर बार रिस्टार्ट मरे चो तात अच्छा बैटरी टकी बायोस डू के देखते बच्चों बैटरी टक नीचे की ना टाइम टक प्रॉपर्ली दीच्छे की ना बट ओ नो तून बैटरी रिप्लेस करो जेताई तो तू मेरा काज करो सेट ठीक है चे वो टा ठीक है आमर एक बार मन बोल चे तू आरेख बार भालोकरा मशीन टक रिस्टार्ट दाओ आरेख बार रिस्ट NT5 DS अच्छे ताई तो ठीक अच्छे तुम्ही एक बार मशीन टक पोथो में एक बार काज करो पोथो में एक मशीन टक रिस्टार्ट दाओ रिस्टार्ट दे आर पड़े तुम्ही जे कमांड गुला अच्छे सीक्वेंस कमांड वो गुलो चला बे चला पड़ आबार एक बार रिस्टार्ट दे बे हाँ तो तुम ही तो एक बार एक बार मारो एक बार टाइम टाइम मारो एक बार सेम डेटा रीस्टार्ट करो हम्म हाँ हाँ ओके सो द डोमेन कंट्रोलर वी हैव क्रिएटेड वी हैव रन द सिस्प्रेप एंड देन आई मेक इट पावर ऑन
so I'm creating one user clear this thing I have done then log on with log off and join this machine to the domain. So this is your domain joint system, right? Perfect. Okay. Now I will collect three wallpaper. One I will apply on site, one I will apply on domain and one I will apply on OU. And next what we can do, we will see which one is applying on my users. Clear? So for that only, yes, I am yes. going to create one OU structure.
okay perfect this is our structure we will structure one is for onkur another for the sapun these two guys my business users let's download three wallpaper for our three different policies so one wallpaper i am downloading this one <coughs> g a dot j p g okay perfect another wallpaper i am applying this one and another i am applying this one clear now i'll just copy all of three leaf dr and j into our <coughs> where should i copy where should i copy to our domain controller right yes so basically we have to keep them in a share path remember we have to keep them Season. in a exactly because we cannot create a separate share in domain controller inside it is a serious compliance policy so whatever the default share we will put it there clear yes. never create any share folder inside the domain controller you may if you do this and somehow it will becomes an audit you can lose your jobs i'm telling you it's very very is poison a toxic job if you create any share folder inside the domain controller and serious compliance issue just copy them all inside the server got it okay make it for the information make it site make it domain make it oyu clear
oh sorry now all three files I'll put it in our domain share so how I can put it on domain share how I can put it on domain share shall I go to run and then type my lab dot and then I'll put it here will it be work will it be work it will never work because it is no. it is readable uh, sorry uh, readable share path it is not writable clear so in that case what should I do where should I go where should I go Okay, so I'll put it in this particular path. Remember, C Windows Sysball again, Sysball again, the domain name and slash script. Got it? Do not po paste it here in policy because policies contain only your group policy template file. So do not paste it here. Do not touch this. This is the engine of your group policy templates. But do not touch this. Okay? Clear? So put it on script. So whenever you put it here, it will be replicated all this machine, all the domain controller, it will be replicated through sysball migration. Clear? Perfect. Yes. Now I'll create a three policy. One for domain wallpaper policy, another for OU wallpaper policy, another for site wallpaper policy. How do that? Go to central GP store. That is gpmc.msc. Clear? Got it? Yes. Perfect. So, here what we can do, we'll go to, see, whenever you are creating any group policy, better always create on group policy object because your group policy object means it's a residential place for all the group policy object or it is a home location of your group policy. The first policy name is first policy name is domain underscore wallpaper once you click on it then you have options you just go and Okay, let's create all three policy first. Domain wallpaper policy. Second one is site wallpaper policy. Site underscore wallpaper policy. Third one will be OU. OU underscore wallpaper policy. clear okay so now if I go to domain wallpaper policy If I go to domain wallpaper policy, then where do I have to go? Go to policy, administrative template, desktop, right? And desktop. So first, make it enable because or else GP, uh, JPG image it will not tank. And then wallpaper policy, desktop wallpaper policy. 
where is your location make it stretch where is your location sysvol script so put it here once you put it here you will see all the group policies the first one i am creating for domain right yes so put it here so domain policy has been done successfully let's go for ou wallpaper third one is site wallpaper This is for site, right? Site. Perfect. So that means my site was ready my wallpaper is ready my domain wallpaper oh wallpaper is ready my domain wallpaper is ready perfect now what i can do so first one i will apply on the domain link existing policy which is one domain got it domain i am apply the policy on domain how i am doing this uh, uh just go uh -huh. to domain right click link existing gpo domain wallpaper got it now you go to site so right now you have not created any site let's create the site first because it's only for the one domain controller so site will not be able to understood got my point it will be effective if you have multiple domain controller and you have configured the proper replication then it is very visible to you as it is default site so first make it one site So I'll move the server to local.
okay now i'll go to the site so in local link existing gpo that is site wallpaper policy clear got it yes okay yes after that ou business users right click link existing gpo ou wallpaper policy now question is after you done this you have to run the gpo update forms now next question is you have applied one wallpaper three app wallpaper one is domain one is sites and one is ou which one will be apply for users right let's log into the machine with the users name who is my users shopon and onkur Well, this is not applied. Okay, so I'll make it GP update force. Now my question is why the policy is not applying here why the policy is not applying here hmm let's stop the firewall it causes the problem both the firewall i'm going to stop it now we will check what exactly the our policy is that if i go to my ou if i go to my ou and if i change the precedence see that which one is the apply first well ah after after nature domain domain next site default domain policy it's fine and then finally is domain site will not apply site will not apply because the system it's not for the sites so site wallpaper only for the computer configuration not for user configuration only domain controller configuration only site wallpaper clear uh, okay so that is that just to be confused and just simply to understand I am telling you that 
in this particular users will you able to see the inheritance inside whatever you have apply because if you apply the policy on site where it is applied it is applied on domain controllers not for the local systems right because the local system not in sites you got my point site lo in local system not in sites it will be on domain controller so definitely which is domain controller policy you can apply on sites not for generic user site user policy clear <coughs> not local system domain controller systems only for domain controller policy you can apply on site okay, okay. only on the domain, domain controller. controller exactly exactly so next question is if i see the ou wallpaper is on highest precedent very good but my question is well then why not we can change it why not it is applying so let's now do the troubleshooting so in that case We'll go to this policy and see where is the wrong. Where is the wrong mm, domain dot jpg? We have done this everything, but why not it's applying? Okay, so now again do the jp update force. still the policy is not applying is the reason behind that is the server ways okay if it is let's create one system
still the policy is not applied. That's my point. So, might be chances if the global, if the wallpaper is crashed, might be <coughs> chances of the wallpaper is crashed. Don't worry uh, what we can do, just change the wallpaper. Just change the wallpaper. I will not touch the group policy, nothing else. Just download one wallpaper and put it domain.jpg. Got it? So, OU wallpaper, I am just deleting it. This one I am changing it. So, according to the policy, hmm. do you understand what is the policy? I have wrongly attached the domain GPG. That is the problem. That's what I thought. Why it is not applied? Okay, OUGPG has been made. Perfect. 
then do the GP opted ports. So do you, did you understand what, why it was not applying? Because same policy is holding two same wallpaper. Two different policies holding the same wallpaper. That is why it is conflicting. That was my fault. So what I can do now, I'll update my GPO. Now it is applying, right? Is it applying or not? Yes, applying. So my so my concern is if the wallpaper you have attached on uh, domain and same another wallpaper attached on view. So which one will be on priority? Which one will be on priority? Ah, how you know? How you how you know the which one will applying first? Just select the OU, go to Group Policy Inheritance. See that. Which one is the highest priority? OU wallpaper. Clear? Yes. Perfect. So this is actually precedence. The lowest precedence, highest priority. Clear? This precedence cannot be changed. Precedence can change if let's say in this particular organization you have applied four wallpaper policy or four other policy then you manually you can change the policy but right now if it is applying from domain then another upstream it cannot be work whatever default it will be applied clear so uh, what, what i can understand if uh, there are uh, four uh, OU, uh, OU policy for the wallpaper uh -huh. so that can be taken into the precedence. Yes. Uh -huh. So you can change manual precedence there. So let's say if I apply another wallpaper here, just make it here for information. Just blank template I'm telling you. Group policy, G group policy update. So now you can change the precedent to one. Got my point? So both the wallpaper policies applying here. Okay. So now you can change it, but this option it's not okay. The you have to create the same wallpaper policy, then that um, option will come. Got my point? Then this option will come. Clear. So press. Sorry, sorry. Your voice is clear. Not clear. Tell me. Yeah. So the, the last thing that uh, you could not understand. Two uh, uh, wallpaper policy for the OU. See, if you have two wallpaper policy, okay. Let's create one more wallpaper. Okay.
let's say I'm just applying this site wallpaper here okay for information just to show you that two policy it's the same contain clear now in this OU which one you can apply OU to wallpaper or here you can make the precedence up got my point see that okay so link order you can change precedent here you can come to link order now I want you understood what I'm trying to say Ankur concentrate this hello yes. first things first conta OU wallpaper shetha put chetha ito to ami jodhi chai je OU2 wallpaper ta ke aage di ti tale tumi er order ta ke change kore dao बुझे बोल ले आह ऑर्डर टक ये एक सेकंड ऐसा ना बिजनेस हो तो जाबे लिंक ऑर्डर आह अच्छा लिंक ऑर्डर ये टा आचे तो ये टा के टॉप कर दो ये जे वो यू ये टा के सिलेट करे ये ये टा के टिप पे देबे अब अब देखो ताले देख बे वो यू टू वाल पे पटे प्रायोरिटी वाने चलेगा लो चलेगा लो तो ये बर � gp update slash force I'm doing ये वॉलपेपर गुलो तो मुझे जो फ़ोनो प्रॉब्लम आ चें ये ये वॉलपेपर गुलो नीचे ना चें ठीक है जो मैं उन्हें एक टा वॉलपेपर है जाइ वो तो पढ़े ये वॉलपेपर गुलो तो झाड़ो चें Right, you will be putting me. It any day.
स्निप कर सब भलो झमेला हटाओ तो पलिसी अलरेडी छो टू वालपेपर पलिसी जो छो त देखे नाओ पलिस नाम तो सेम छो कि खाटा कि जस्ट लिंक अर्डर आई हाव चेज लिंक अर्डर आई हाव चेज ओन ओ टू वालपेपर तब इफ आई गो टू इनहरिटेंस हुई वन उज द फार्स्ट प्रायरिटी वालपेपर टू right ou2 wallpaper instead of ou wallpaper policy right so let's see which one is applying
now it is applying now it is applying yes if you again change the link order if you again go to link here and make this on priority just select this one and top it but condition is that both the policy or whatever the policy you have that should be on in the same way if it is upstream it cannot be show it here it cannot be show it here only this showing because if the these two policy in the same way then only you can change the priority order okay that is group policy precedence clear again you do gp update slash force again it was changed clear sapon clear hoyeche to concept ta so then what we have learned today we have learned the group policy how the method of group policy applying process which can locally which you can apply site which you can apply domain and which we can apply on oyu now second techniques we learn if the wallpaper two wallpaper policy which is an apply on domain and which is apply on ou which will be the apply on users finally user will get which wallpaper so i have proved uh, you know that ou is the highest priority ou policy whatever you are linking it is applying clear next if i coming group policy precedence so what is group policy precedence you have you have options to if multiple group policy attached on ou not upstream policy again i'm saying you not upstream policy if multiple group policy attach on ou so through link order you can change the group policy priority which one will be the top so in this change if you change the link order you can apply the group policy accordingly so i have created two multiple group policy and when i changing the order it is changing the group policy applying the uh, priority accordingly clear yes. perfect next classes i will tell you uh, group policy block inheritance and gpo enforcement clear is that clear yes. okay so here let me show you okay for your information okay i'm just uh, i'm just cre creating the group policy block inheritance as well it's nothing just nothing i am breaking the order policy just i'm breaking the order policy that means the policy is applying on business users right the policy is applying on business users nothing just go to dsa.msc under business users create one sub oyu
under business users create on Savu. What is the name? Business critical. So definitely, whenever you are applying the policy on business users, any users under this critical OU, you will you policy will be replicated. Policy will be replicated. So I'll put it onkur over here. Move to onkur over here. Now I am what I'm doing it in business critical OU. If I go to business users, yeah, in business critical, I want that what are the policies applying on business users OU or upstream domain policy, it will not apply to me. In that case, I have to just go to and block inheritance. Block inheritance means what? Upstream policy will not apply to me. Upstream policy will not apply to me. Okay. Clear? Now, what happened? Onkur is disabled, make it enable. Okay. Now I'll log in laptop with Ankur. None of the policies applying. None of the policies applying. Why? Because I have inheritance is blocked. Ah, inheritance is blocked. But inheritance can be cracked. A block inheritance that can be cracked by using GPO enforcement that I show you on next week. Clear? Is that clear? Yes. Now concept of this of this demonstration is clear, everyone, right? Yes. Yeah.